Hey everybody, it's Lon Seidman. We're taking a look today at a OtterBox case for the iPhone 7 Plus. This is their commuter and it's the blue version of it. And there's two components to this case, which by the way, came in free of charge through the Amazon Vine program. Uh, we've got a rubber portion here and then the actual plastic rigid case portion. So we're going to see how easy this is to put together. And I've got my seven month old Ellie here. Say hi, Ellie. So there she is. Uh, she's helping me out with the manual here as we're uh, putting things together. So very easy to get this first portion on. It just slides over your phone. It fits pretty nicely. And then we're going to put the rest of the case together. I've done this a few times now. I think the easiest way to get the case on is to uh, kind of insert the top of the phone into the case first before you slide down the rest of it. And that gets it all uh, on there relatively easily. I did find that there is a little bit of an issue getting everything to snap into place, but once it's in, uh, you're good to go. And then uh, you can see now the case is fully applied. The buttons are very easily accessible here. They've got a nice uh, pushing uh, click back on there when you do push down on it. And you also have a very easy access to the silencer on the side, which is good. The power button here is also very accessible and you get a good click on it when you push it down there. This is not a waterproof case, obviously, but your speakers are exposed. Um, there is some uh, covering of the uh, bottom near the, near the connector here. So you might have some accessories that may not like this case because a lot of uh, accessories like to have this whole bottom portion available to you. But at the same time, the uh, weakest portions of the phone tend to be around here on the bottom on the corners and on the top on the corners. So I can see why they did that. Um, but really it feels uh, pretty rugged. I've, I have experience with other similar OtterBox cases like this. My wife has one on her iPhone 6S uh, and we've had that case since she had the 6. So I think about, about two years into it. And that uh, case has held up very, very well over time. And I would imagine this one feels uh, just as sturdy. So I think these will hold up pretty nicely too. So it's nice that you can get an OtterBox case. It's not a uh, complete tank like a lot of their other cases are, which really make the phone a lot bigger. It doesn't add all that much girth and it uh, does give you some protection if you are concerned about dropping your phone there. Let's see how easy it is now to take this off. So let's see if we can just uh, slip it off here without damaging anything. And there we go. So not too bad if you don't want to use a case all the time. Pretty easy to get it off uh, as well and get your phone back to its native uh, configuration. So that will do it for the OtterBox Commuter. And this is Lon Seidman. Thanks for watching. This channel is brought to you by my Patreon supporters. If you want to help the channel, you can by contributing as little as a dollar a month. Head over to lon.tv slash Patreon to learn more. And don't forget to subscribe. Visit lon.tv slash s.